Hi guys, it's Gloria. How is everybody doing? Look at me. I look like I've, I got run by a train. Put this light on. Yeah, that's better. Coming a little late today. I haven't been feeling well, so I figured I'd come up here and, and share with you some of the things that I got. I hope everybody had a nice weekend and um, nice weather out there. Let me get this out of here so that I don't bump into it. I have a few things to share with you guys. Not much, but uh, I haven't been feeling well, so. Uh, but I figure I'll come up tonight. It's a little late. It's at 10 to 25 Eastern time, so. But I still want to share my love with you guys and share the things that I found this week for the upcoming things that I'll be doing in my home. God willing, if I get, you know, feel better. I don't know. I guess the change of weather is like getting to me. So, hi, Media. How are you, sweetie? ¿Cómo estás? Yo estoy, estoy mejor. Pero llevo dos días que estoy. La fiebre me, me está matando. Llevo dos días que no tengo sin energía. So, voy a tener que tomar, comprar vitamina B12 and drink it, you know? I am. Um, I've been meaning to do this video for since uh, Saturday, but. Um, Today is not a great day, but I, I still have a little energy. I was sitting here stamping some stuff for a friend of mine that I'm going to be, something that I want to share with you guys before I ship it out and share with you. So I hope everybody, you know, thank you for the thumbs up, sweetheart. I really appreciate it. I appreciate the love you guys give me because, you know, sometimes, you know, I don't, I don't go like every day, every week. During the week, I do a lot of things. You know, once a week, I probably, you know, I do my once a week, my, share because I, my husband takes me out and my joy is to buy little things here and there uh, and decorate because this is my happy place you know this is where I sit and I I'm around all day long and I love to decorate when I, I feel well I mean I do it in, in stripes you know thank you sweetheart I really appreciate that I, I mean from the bottom of my heart I know you 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 you've been with me for a long time, and I really appreciate that. Um, as you notice, it's, it's, I don't have too much energy today. I just was sitting here, and I know uh, it's kind of late. But hey, if we see you and I, that's it. It's okay. You know, as the, the other girls can always catch up later on. You know, I was gonna put like a time so so they can never say, "No, let me go up live." You know, and that you know, so. It's only you and I so far here, so I guess you know I, I start I, I will start sharing stuff with you and I. I guess that's it. I did a little thumbnail different this time, hoping you know. So anyway, let me share with you since you're the only one that's here. I is three minutes into it and I, I see another person, but they haven't said anything yet. Let me start. Let me share first the project I did for my one of my friends. Actually, we did an exchange. Let me bring this around. It's in the box already. But um, let me put this down. I'm wrapping it in here. Let me see if I can get it out. Yeah. I was having a hard time finding a box. I'll repack it again. But I was working on this full cake. She wanted a, a cupcake, but I. she's such a sweetheart. Look at what I did for her. This is a unicorn cake that I made for her for decoration. So, you know, I use thickle for the tail, you know, to do all the rainbow colors. And this is um, that glass uh, glitter. And then um, the little unicorn in the horn has like, if you see the yellowish thing, those are little stars, did the eyes. And uh, the legs have like little stars. So this is one of them I'm, I'm planning to make for my house. Once I share with you guys here on this coming week, God willing, um, people going crazy with the lemon thing, but what I did was I had some lemons. Don't tell, tell me wrong. I did two topiaries that are already at the table, but I didn't make them big because I couldn't find them at Walmart. But I want to make like a station with lemonade and stuff like that. And then I'm going to incorporate the bees and make a very summery kind of thing. And I'm using yellows and blues. That's my theme. I, I share with you, you know, earlier, I shared the, in another video that the plate, the blue plates that I got from Pier 1. So... She wanted a um, vanilla cake, so I, it looks like vanilla. I stamped it in the back over here, so she knows it's from me. 
but I did that like decorated like if I was I did this with uh, with clay. No. Oh, I got this. I got this one from Hobby Lobby. I have a bigger one that I got at Hobby Lobby that I did for myself that I shared with you in another video. But this smaller one, I got it from Hobby Lobby. This would be nice, like if you're doing a, a child's uh, birthday party, like for decoration. It, it's, it looks, you know, I think it's really nice just to decorate. And then, I, of course, you're going to have the regular cake. You can do cupcakes and stuff like that. So I, I use it a tin cookie can for the vase. I, you, you can buy a box. If you want to, you can get use a round box. And then I use spackle. I, I put all the spackle. I let it dry for one or two days because... Um, sometimes the spackle, depending on the weather outside or the humidity, even though it's inside the house, tends to crack. So I let it dry and then I put another coat into, I seal the complete. So this is what's happening to me. So then I took um, paint. Once it was dry, I took paint and I, um, not, I spackle everything. I did the decorations, the little, little flowers with the, you know, a cake, a regular cake thing, one of those cake, whatever you call them. You know, to decorate cake, and I did all that, and then once it dried completely, that's why it took. I suppose to let mail it to her like two weeks ago, but uh, I told her it's taking a little longer because it's like it has to be dried. I want to make sure, and I want to. It's very detailed. This is very detailed. Um, when you do the with the the, uh, the stickles, you have to make sure the lines and all that kind of stuff. So, I did that, and then the of course the clay. I glue. I, once I did this, I did like a snake kind of thing, and then I did the round thing, and then the flowers. So that's how it looks. She's waiting for it. I was talking to her last night, and I was stamping me earlier. I was stamping some. She likes Halloween. I was stamping. Uh, uh, what do you call that? Uh, some some stamps that she likes that I have. So I figured I said, "Well, I'll stamp you some, and you can put it in the scanning cut, and you will always have it." You know, I stamped them on black and white. This here. Because I, I was looking for the stamps for her, but I couldn't find the different stamps. She can scan them in the, her scanning cut, and then she can she will always have them. So that's what I got. Let me put the box down because then I'm gonna have to. And then I use you know I use this like a, I had this from prior from cakes. You can buy this, or you can even Google. I mean, I didn't put nothing at the bottom because it's for her. If I will sell to this, I will have to put some type of foam or something here to hide all this. But she knows it's you know. I feel it should be okay. I can paint the bottom too. So, so that's what I got. <laughs> I got all the glitter over. Then I after that I sealed it with Mod Podge. That's what I did. So anyway, let me start showing you the other stuff. So I went to Hobby Lobby because I was looking online on Hobby Lobby and I wanted some B stuff. I did. Um, oh, let me show you the other stuff I did. Hold on a second before I continue. And I printed this. I got these three frames in Goodwill, so I had them laying around. So I printed this, and I made this. Well, she we did we did an exchange. I wanted one of those arms for my camera, and I didn't know how to order and stuff. I said, I'll order for so I said, okay, if you order for me, I'll make you a cake. She wanted a cupcake, but, you know, I think the camera thing costs more, so that's why I did, I did a bigger cake. I think she will enjoy it. She wants to display it in her craft room. So I did this one. I printed this on paper, and it says fresh squeezed lemons, and this is going to go in a little corner where I have, I uh, think, whatever you call that, uh, display I'm going to do. I, I wanted the vintage lemon thing, so I got this one. So I painted all this, and I framed it. And then I got this one, famous quote, when life is lemons, make lemonade. Hi, Clint. Hi. Welcome, sweetie. We have Clint here. I'm st I just started sharing. I was sh showing uh, Myrna. Did you see the cake, Clint, that I was showing her? So I got the, you know, I did, I printed and painted this. Sorry for the glare. And I put some, uh, you try to make a thing. Oh, you didn't see the cake? I'll show it to you. I just started showing this stuff. It's a faux cake. I'm making this for Karen. I made it for Karen. Karen King. So this is my faux cake. One of them that I made. It's not to eat. It's just to decorate. Clint. <laughs> so 
So, yeah, I use pickles and uh, what do you call spackle and a tin can. So, it looks yummy, doesn't it? You should see the chocolate one that I made. Anyway, so I did those frames. And then, to go with that, I got this a Tuesday morning. I found this. It's lemonade 50 cents. And what did it say? Tasty and delicious. So this is one of the signs I'm going to be using on my decor. And then I have shared with you last week, I got this of uh, Hobby Lobby. I'm going over the place today, guys. I got this last week. I haven't finished with this. I think I'm going to paint this frame like a blue because my theme is yellow and blue and the, the things are upside down. This is why I got for $4.40 from Hobby Lobby. So I got that. So you see where I'm going. But my house is not going to be all that. So then from Hobby Lobby, I got this little sign. Everything was 40%. Yeah, 40%. I got this Be Thankful. So cute. Love it. It was originally $6.99. It was 40%. So like $3.50 maybe. No, $3.50 would be, let's see, six dollars would be $3. So, so like $3.50 or $3.49 or something like that. Give or take. Then I got this one, Galvanize, says be happy. And this was $11.99. So I think this was like $8 in some sense, but it's, you know, wood and the brown on the side. And this is, let me see how big this is. I have the, the measuring thing up here, backwards here. Okay, so one, two, three, seven and a half wide, round, seven and a half. So seven and a half, seven and a half. So we're eight something. Right, the blue, the blue will be nice for around it because I have, I got some, I'll show you the flowers in a second. Then I found this. This is supposed to be a stone for the, you know, to put on the garden, but I'm, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to do something else with it. But I fell in love with it because it looks like the honeycomb and the V and this. You know, my husband, it's so funny. My husband is allergic to Vs. If he gets stung, it's bad. Uh, this was $14.99. It was 40% of what is kind of heavy. I'll figure something out. Maybe I'll put it on a stand and, and let it sit in a table or something. I, I It's so beautiful. See how pretty it is? So it doesn't have nothing to hang on, but I don't want to hang it. I just want to sit it somewhere. <laughs> yeah, I love them. They're pretty. I'm going to make... Uh, I got the, 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 the twine to make the... The beehive thing, whatever you call that. I hear then this oh, this one says be kind. So I'll probably put like a little yellow blow bow with blue over here to bring the colors in. Or maybe this little V over here. I'll paint it yellow, you know, detail it, change the sign a little bit. And this was also eleven ninety nine. Kind of kind of expensive, but eight dollars or something. And then I got this other sign that was $14.99. Q as can be. So got that. Then I am going to be using these little bees. They're so cute. The week before that, you have them. Uh, I'm going to put them on the beehive once I make it. So I got two packages of these. These were not on sale. I, I think I used a 40% and I have my husband use a 40%. Hi, Davida. You missed the cake. I showed the cake. This was $3.99 and, four, and I used 40% and my husband used the other 40%. I'm going be high. <laughs> Let me show David the cake. Hi, Katzel. There is the cake, darling. Davida is the trainer. She's my teacher. Yeah, I'm gonna send this to Karen. And, you know, she's um I already have a package. I'm gonna send it to her this week. So yeah, I'm sending this package. Your package is going also cat Um uh I'm sending something to somebody else who oh uh, uh Biddy Boo, whatever her name is. I still haven't gotten her address. I don't know what's going on, but so hi Maria. So those are the bees I got for the beehive I'm gonna make. Let me re show you some of the ones that came late. Hobby Lobby. Oops. This one. 
and this one's where then this is my favorite. I love this one. So cute. Besides the, the stone. Be happy. And this is my favorite. I love this one. This is a stone for the garden, but I love that. So I'm still working on my lemon plates. I just cleaned the area because I have much patch of this. I have to do the details to go around this. These are some of the plates, but I have some other plates that I bought. So that's all the stuff I got. Let me see what else I got from Hobby Lobby. I got, let me look at this bag. The famous fruits. I went back, you know, they, they were so nice. What's that? Uh, where were you? Oh, Mar oh, Maria. Wasn't she in your live video before, David? I thought she was. So I went, back, when I went to Hobby Lobby, the girls know me already there. So they knew that the week before when I went and got some of the fruits and vegetables, they didn't have some other stuff. So this time I went and then she gave it to me for 50% of which was really nice. <laughs> so I got, um, oops, two, two of these, even though I have some from Easter, but I got two because I like these. I like this, the fact that this is this. I can probably imitate this. And these were like $2.99, so I paid $1.50 for each. I got some of these. Oh, you were driving home? Oops. Okay, stay there, avocado. Got two bushes of this, I think. This is, I don't know, this is cilantro. It looks like cilantro. I think I got two of these. I got an avocado that was $2.99, so I paid 50% off. And these were $2.99 a bushel, so that was $50 each. Then I got myself two onions, $2.99 each, so $2.99 for the two, because they were 50%. They gave me the discount. Where are you going? Oh, okay. Let me drop you here. I have the basket here, because I have to start changing stuff around. And I was looking for these, because I didn't have the last week, the week before, so I got myself two, two bushels of the cherry tomato. They look so freaking real, guys. Look at this. And the, my hair is attached to it too. Eh. And these were originally $3.99. So I paid $3.99 for the two. But they look so real. You even touch them, they feel like real ones. So I got those. I got green paint that I, I was looking for green paint the other day to do something. I didn't do it. I didn't, I didn't find it. So I got three bottles of those. They were on, on sale too. They were 50% off. Got myself two more of these breads. I got one of these and one of these. So I got one already that last, the week before. So these were originally $2.99. So I pay a uh, dollar fifty each. Yeah, a dollar fifty each. And then I got these because I'm gonna put this with the cheese that I got. So this is gonna look cute with the cheese. And I'm trying to figure out how they you know they use foam for this. That's why they use foam, and then they painted it. This is what it is, it's foam. When you squeeze it, you can feel it, it's foam. So it was $1.99, so they were a dollar each. So that's all the fruits I got, because I had to, I added to the other basket that I have here. They had, I got myself this glue gun, because my husband, went, I burned myself so bad over here, I don't know if you can see it. I still have the scar that he was worried so because I don't feel this stuff. So I got this that has two temperatures and it shuts itself off. So it's a mini size, it's similar to the one I have. But this one I got uh, uh, Joanne's and it's the same, basically the same thing. But this one, I guess the newer one was $10.99 originally. So I use 40% on this. What the the craft room? Yeah, I've been changing stuff around. Stuff around. Um, what else did I have from there? Trying to see. Huh. Okay, let me bring this up. <laughs> little by little, guys. <sighs> so I went to. Is this from TJ Maxx or from this is from? I think this is from TJ Maxx, yeah. Oh, there's the thing. Okay. So I went to TJ Maxx 
And you know, like the week before, I shared with you guys the lemonade. Uh, think what you call that the jar that you the thing that you pour. Okay, I forget. So I found myself the mugs. It says lemonade. So I got these, and they were $16.99 for the four. And even if you know, even after this player, you can use it for regular things. So Oh, thank you, girls. So I got this to put it with the jar, the little watering jar, whatever you call that thing. $16.99 at TJ Maxx. I was surprised to find that. Then I found this. Ooh, look at what I found. I found the uh, stamps. <laughs> These to put, I'm gonna make like a little vignette. So this says squeeze. This is also very done. And I, th I debated it because I see it like for the past three weeks. I said, oh, I don't know. So I came up with this idea. So I this was $12.99. They, they, they increased the, all the, the, the very done stuff by $2, guys, each. Everything is $2 more. Then I was dabbing there that and um, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, all around. Many times looking for the lemon place, Davida. And look what I found. I sent you pictures, though. I found these. They're melanin plates. They were three ninety nine, but because I want, I wanted something blue, so I found these. I got. They were only have, only have four of these, because you know I have the the walls that I display. So they were three ninety nine, so I got all four, and they're gonna go with the blue plates as a background, and then because I have all the plates, I'm gonna put there. I got this one. This were three ninety nine also. But I love because it has the lemon, it has the blue that I was looking for. I didn't want plain blue. I just wanted, I mean, plain lemons. I just wanted something with blue. And when I saw this, I fell in love with it. And I didn't care if it were plastic or not. <laughs> $3.99. And then for the china closet, I am going to put this in the bottom part. Found this lovely, lovely thing made in Italy. This one was $19.99, and it's handmade in Italy, dishwash safe and microwave safe. So I can put a turkey here or a, a, some type of bird. Yes, lemons and bees, but it's not going to be all in one section. It's going to be all over the house. I'm going to incorporate, basically, I'm going with yellows and blues. And lemons are perfect for the summer, and blue is good for the 4th of July that we or, or Memorial Day. So... And this will still work with that, the decoration for the 4th of July because it's in the summer. So I can incorporate things. I have to make things easy for me because sometimes my energy level, like this past two days, has been crazy. So the, I got that. And then I found this. I was walking out. I found this. Very vintage -y. So right now I, had, uh, I took all the bunnies out. And I left the, the greenery and the, the purples and yellows. So the yellows is it's like the base of the decorations that I have. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to take the purples out for the, that I have for Easter. And I'm going to leave the yellow. And then I'm going to start incorporating blues. And I got this from Hobby Lobby. I've got to show you the flowers. So I got these flowers that were on sale, 50% off. I paid a dollar each. So they're so pretty, look. And of course, it has one, two, three, four that I can, you know, incorporate, take the purple out, put the, the blues in. So I got one, I think I got like 10, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12. I got 12 of the big ones, and I got two of these little ones. So uh, it's going to have that, it's going to have that little blue touch of that. It's like a blue, like it's not, it's blue, but it's not that bright blue. It's not the dark blue. So I'm pretty sure I can take it. Then what will happen, I'll leave the blue in and incorporate red when 4th of July comes in. So that way only I only have to take one part of the, the design out. 
So I don't know what I'm gonna do with the mantle yet, um, because I, I'm, 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 I don't know. I'm thinking, thinking, thinking here. My brain doesn't stop thinking. I can't sleep well. I had to get blood tests this morning. You should see me in the morning. <laughs> I was like, oh God, they wanted to give me an appointment at eight o'clock. I said, no way, eight o'clock. I'm not gonna be up. So I, they gave me a point for 10. So that's all I got from there. And from Tuesday morning, I didn't get much because they didn't have much. I did get three more boxes. I got two more of these. So I'm changing, you know, the blues and the things. So I got this one. And they were $10, $8.99. This is the medium one. I got two of the medium ones that they didn't have anymore. And then I got this baby one. I found a baby one. That's one of the ones I shared with you last time. Yes, once I finish, Maria will, yeah. Davida, when are you doing your tour? Are you not doing a tour that collaboration this, this time? I usually do it when Davida, yeah. I love this blue. So I found this is the baby one. So I'll be putting stuff in here. And then I was looking around and I found this. That goes with the, the remember the, the black ones that I shared with you last week, the week before? This was $4.99. And the baby one, this one was $7.99. So I, pay, I got everything that they had. Because this is so cute. So I can put stuff here. I can put my ephemera here. I can put a lot. I'm changing stuff around and, and naming them. Because that way I can find stuff. So I got that. Let me put it back in here so it's organized. Okay, and the last thing I got from there, I didn't have much this week. Oh, I found these two little birds. Look how cute. Love those boxes. They're very good to store stuff, and they look pretty when you display them. So this one is facing this way, and this one is so... Look how chunky they are. They're so adorable. They were $2.99 each. They're made like a cement, I think. But the way they, uh, you know... Then I got this glitter thing. It's a paste, Biki Boo, and they have some another te texture paste. They have some some other one that was I think gray, but I didn't get it. I got this one, so it has like a glittery thing. It's called texture paste. It really, I can't see this thing. Well, it, it's that it, that one that show the, the different colors. So I got that. Then I found some this. This I've been looking for the Harry Potter stamp uh, dies. They don't have them here, and the 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 stamps for Disney. None of that stuff here. But I did find this. It says Friends. I blotted off this thing, so I got three of these or whatever they had. I got it three. I was greedy, <laughs> and they were a dollar forty nine. I don't know if you want to see the number. Let's see. Ah, it's blurry. Oh well. Let's see. Uh, twenty one zero five eight one five. So they had three. So I got a so dollar fifty sticker. I got one little tape. And then, guys, you know me and Alice in Wonderland. I love Alice in Wonderland and Tinkerbell. So they had these. And I got, they have four, and I picked up all four. I didn't leave nothing because when they go there, they don't leave nothing for me either. There's this lady that goes and buys everything in the store. She, I think she's there when they open the store. So I, they have four of these, and I got all four of them. And that's it. That's all I got, I think. Is that all I got? Yeah, that's all I got. I was poor this week. I didn't want to spend I wasn't. I haven't been feeling well, so that's the word. I can't say it really, it really sent glitter. I can't say the word. It says it on the bottle, <laughs> Maria, but I can't pronounce it. So, so I'm doing li things little by little. Oh, let me show you the little topiaries that I made. Let me, I'll be back. I put them in the table.
You remember I shared with you the candlesticks, right? There were three different colors. So I changed the colors. And this was beige I got from Hobby Lobby. I changed that. And here's my topiaries. They're not tall, they're tiny. Look how I did the, the, the stem. It looks like a real stem, doesn't it? You know how I did this? This is with a dowel. I painted the dowel brown. Then I took uh, glue from the glue gun and I made the things around. And then I took a foam ball of moss and the strawberry, uh, the strawberry, listen to me, the lemons and some leaves. And I made it for my table. Because I didn't want them too tall because, you know, they're on the stand. Instead of putting candles or stuff, I might want to put maybe some fairy lights in the bottom. Or I, th I was thinking of, like, putting something that hangs greenery. So it, el it elongates. I was looking from the lanai. I said, this is something. You know when you do something? Then I found these little flowers that I had here. So I cut a few of them and the blossoms. So I got that. And um, the big lemon, this is from... Who did I get this from? The, the, the lemons I got from different place. This one I think I got, I don't know why I got that, this one kind, but this one I think I got a Hobby Lobby. Then this one's I got a Michael's. So, and then these little flowers, I had them. So, so what I did was, uh, since this kept moving around, hi, Oreo time. I put some, I was gonna tell you, show you this, Davida. Where is it? The blue dots, you put it in the bottom, you don't have to glue it because if you put the blue dots or whatever the thing touches and it holds it in place, it doesn't, if it, you know, if it moves, it won't come down. But then you, it allows you to take it off and not ruin the piece. Like you don't want, sometimes you don't want to glue stuff, but you want to hold it in place. So that's what I did. So I put three little dots and it stays there. Look. And this is the the eight pound ones. Is a hold. It has it's a half half an inch because they have different ones. And make sure it has this picture because this is used for these kind of things because they have different ones. So when you don't you want to hold something and you don't want to you know how I break stuff when I'm using when I'm uh, I'm showing stuff I bump into things. This is gonna prevent me from doing that. You know what I'm saying? Like remember that that jar that I broke that I got at Kirkland's. So uh, D Danielle, uh, she was the one who who found this, and she, uh, my, myself, Arlene, country, crap, whatever her thing, and we've been using this to hold the stuff because you don't want it. Sometimes you don't want to glue stuff permanently, you know. So this, you can pull it out. Look, see. And it's right there. And you can take it off. It's like a little plastic. Then you can plastic it back on. Look. And it stays in place. That's it. It's like a little, like a little sticky thing. It's supposed to be used for all you know, this. This all purpose dot. And uh this one brings 300 and um is a multi-surface half an inch because they have small, you have to get the half an inch is the biggest one I've seen. I wish they made it bigger, but they don't. So, and it comes like in a little roll like this. And that's how they, you see how they, where they are right here. Yeah, you see? And like, if I want to attach this inside, I can put this around in the wall and it will hold it. If you put a few of them, believe it or not. It holds up to eight pounds and you don't have to nail nothing to the wall or anything like that. So when I, every time I go there, I use my 40% because I don't know how much this was, but I found it a Hobby Lobby in the craft section. I think Michael's has it too, but this is a half an inch. Remember half an inch, all purpose. So my friends, that's all I have. I have to work. I want to make um what do you call that i want to make a, a lemon meringue not a lemon meringue i want to make um what a lemon a full lemon pastry something <laughs> i'm doing bad guys today my brain is unfortunately right when i feel like this is like bad 
I go like that, like the lamb. <laughs> yeah, the dots are there, awesome. I ever since Danielle introduced us to us, what do you think about those things? You know, even in these little birds, when I put them on top of something, sometimes you're liable to bump into them. You put them in, you put two of them in the bottom, put them somewhere, and they stay. And even though they're little heavy, so oh. This is what I did for Daniel. Girls, remember that uh, Castle has a challenge going to the 15th of May. So this is a little card I did for her. This I don't know. I know you wanted something else, but I just did this because this is the only thing that's going to be fitting in that box. <laughs> so I put this so you can make the holes and, and put it on your, uh, what do you call that? The, the Rolodex card that you, you think. So I figured you can put two holes there. What do you think, Castle? So it's a little shaker, and I put my information in the back, and I attach this so that way you can make the holes here and put it there. And I was looking for a Rolodex speeding thing, and um, Karen found it, and uh, she lives, lives in West Virginia, and she goes to these uh, second-hand places, and she found it for 25 cents. I was so happy when she called me and told me she found it. So, so once she sends it to me, I'll have the dimension, and maybe I can send you some more, uh, Kathy. You know, I'll make some more in, in, in different colors, decorate them, and send it to you. But I was going to do, like, um, a stuff uh, envelope, like you, one of the things. But I said, you know, where am I going to fit? It's not going to fit. So my stuff envelope is the stuff box, so you know. <laughs> not that I want, you know, it's up to you. But, and I put your little name on it. Look, it says Kathy in there. And shake it for pineapple. Now, guys, I have a pineapple that I bought up here one. It's like a jug. It's a beautiful pineapple I have. And I have my wine cart, the liquor cart. I have liquor there and nobody drinks it because nobody drinks here. And you, Davida, you something else. <laughs> so I am going to do that. I'm going to put that there. I'm going to put my pineapple stuff. You'll see. You have to see. You have to stay tuned for it. It's going to take me a little bit. I have to do it before I leave because I'm leaving the 17th. God willing. So it's already the first. Oh. So anyway, I have to do it by, hopefully by in. When are you doing your thing, Davida? Your your tour. That be the enabler. <laughs> she was showing that that lemon cake she was showing today was look so yummy. <laughs> oh, okay, I'll be gone, but I have to do mine before then. Or oh, probably I can videotape it and um, post it on that day from New Jersey. I'll be in New Jersey. Well, actually, I'll be leaving in the, at night, so it's not. I can do it during the day, probably. I'm going, I'm going to New Jersey to visit my daughter. She's um, she's going to, on a trip with a couple of friends. And I'm going to stay with my grandkids. My older daughter is going with me for a couple of days too. So I'll be in New Jersey for a little while. I'll probably do something over there. You know, like last time, last last summer, I did the, 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 the hole from the uh, deck where the kids were in the pool. So, Yeah. Hopefully, I won't feel as bad as I feel now. It's like they just do blood of work today. I went to have blood work, and on the 15th, they're going to the doctor wants to see me. So uh, I don't know if it's lack of bite. I don't understand because I eat very healthy, you know. But I think it's the fibromyalgia. I have to call this girl because I, I, I was looking. What's her name? Uh, Sonia wanted to find. She wanted this ephemera. I had to mail her this. She lives in New Jersey. I could basically bring it to her, but um, I want, I want, I'm looking to see if I find the other stuff that I found to, to give her the stuff because she has the, the thing. Oh, Kat, so I found when I was looking for the paper, I found another paper pad from this collection. I don't know if you want it. I'm going to include it in your box. If you want it, if not, you can share it, whatever you want to do, okay? So it's from the Glitter Girl. Hi, Grandma Joe. 
So I'm gonna include it in that box. So it should be going this because finally got found the box for the unicorn. Because I was having a hard time trying to get unicorn a box. I was saying it's not to be. Honey, don't it's, you God bless me with the life I have. They, I, I don't know if you know. Um, some of the girls here know, but I'm here because of God's mercy and He has blessed me greatly. And if I can bless you or anybody in a way, if I can, I know you do crafts too. And I know, you know, if I have extra, hey. I'm not what I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna use everything. I do it from the bottom of my heart, the kindness of my heart. Nothing, I'm not expecting anything. I I enjoy being with you guys. I love the fact that you share the love and you care for me to come here and spend time with me. And I do appreciate that. And um, if I find it in my heart to share something with you guys, I'll do it, you know. Oh, um, I um they have to once every six months they because of the medication that they give me, I have to get drop drop blonde and they have to check, make sure, and then also I'm due for my annual. So I you know, I, I don't know as a lot of people it's easier to say the words than what you feel, but um I do I do when I speak to you guys, I really, really mean it. You know, you girls are every week with me and you're always there with me, you know, and um, sometimes I look like today and sometimes I have my makeup on. Sometimes I look like a down and you're still there. Give me that moral support that, yes, you have family around, but sometimes you need extra people out there that, you know, and like Davida says, you have to spread the love, you know. So, I am sorry, guys. I'm being like sentimental today. It's one of those days that, um, hi, Susan. How you doing, sweetheart? No, nothing is wrong, Grandma. It, Joe, it's just that sometimes I, 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 I'm, I get emotional because, um, the world, so people have so much hate out there, and to find a great group of ladies like you come here and week by week, uh, spend time with me. Um, I do it once a week. I don't sometimes twice a week, depending on what I'm doing, but mostly once a week, I try to come in and, you know, it's, you know, it's, you need friends. You do, you do need friends beside family. You need people that even though they don't know you, they, they, that you know that they do care because they don't come just to see what, yeah. I mean, they have to be something more than just see what you show. And I'm pretty sure all of you have different things going on in your life too, you know, so, and that's appreciated, is 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 well appreciated. Yeah, it's some of the day I don't like to cry too much. I, I try not to, I, I try to be strong, but sometimes they come out, you can't help it. It's like, thank you, Castle. I really appreciate that. So I don't, you know, I tried to laugh. Last week I was laughing my head off. Today I'm crying. You see what what's happening? <laughs> it's crazy. It's this is this 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 stuff that happened to me is sometimes kind of hard. I don't want to feel pity for myself. I I never do. I that's not me. Hi, TN girl, two twenty four. How are you, sweetie? Hi, Lisa. That's Lisa with the, what is it, the 411. <laughs> Lisa, I love her watching her. I don't comment or anything, but I, I, I just sit there and watch her and start laughing. She makes my day when she does her video. <laughs> Lisa's holes. <laughs> yes, Lisa, Lisa, the 411. What's the 411, guys? What's going on? <laughs> yeah. So. I watch your videos every time you have one up. Sometimes I come and maybe once in a blue moon, but I sit there and I laugh so much with the things you do. <laughs> I I miss that finger, that that little that tomb that you had. It was so funny. So I was uh, um I had to I had to work on making a little more cakes. I I ha I think I'm gonna make I wanna make you know how they made those um cherry pies but they had the the 
the the slices of lemons and oranges in top to decorate it. That's what I want to make. So I'm, I know, I don't know if I, I should make it uh, with a foamy thing. What do you think, David? With a foamy thing is easier, right? Because I know you made one with, was it a plaster? Not plaster. You made it with, uh, what do you call the, the other stuff? Oh, David, that's so sweet of you saying that. Yes, there you go, Maria. You know, sometimes you get emotional, but it's a good emotion. And at the same time, you cry and you laugh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I haven't had much sleep lately, you know. Okay, clay. But you use, you, didn't you use clay for the top when you put the, remember you put the aluminum foil inside? And then you put, uh, you, you put, you use clay, didn't you? I think that's what you used. Hmm. But I was thinking, well, I guess that I could do it the way you did it too. Hi, Cheryl. Welcome, honey. You did that, they're tiny. I took a, a dowel like this and I cut it in half. And I wanted them small because I, want, I was going to put them in top of the candle holders. Now, if you want to make a nice big one, you can use this. This is 12. Is it 12? I said, yeah. Let's see. Yeah, this is 12 inches tall. So there's there's six. And then the, the, the little ball, I got it from Dollar Tree, the medium ones, the, the foam ball, put moss on them and then attach the leaves and the and the lemons. Cheap, cheap, cheap. Like uh what's her name? It says uh this girl from uh, I forget her name. <laughs> oh my ears hurting. So I used this, I painted this brown, then I put mixed the brown with the green. I use a green like this to mix it in and it turns into, but then after I painted it brown, what I did, I went with my glue gun. I wish I could be better at doing videos, but I, I like tutorial. I just went around like this, put the, the, the glue, let it dry. And then I painted it green and then I went with the brown again and the green and it gave that color. The salt dough for the cherries. I, I got cherries from uh, from um, from Hobby Lobby. I have a bag, and I have strawberries in a bag. I made sure I I, um, I hatch a, a couple of bags, so that way I have them in my stash. <laughs> but remember last year during Christmas time when I made the, the, the this year when I made the cakes for Valentine's. Was it Valentine's? Yeah, Valentine's. Uh, all the cakes I put, the, the little candy, the, the gummy candies, I got those uh, from the Christmas, during Christmas time, they had that sweet section, that miniature. They had the little gum drops and all that stuff. I, I got a bunch of bags and that's what I, I was able to decorate my cakes with that. Because they were, uh, they were when they went 40% off, I got a bunch of bags. I got the gum drops and I got the little, this, you know, they, you, you usually use them for to decorate the, the, the small Christmas tree. So it's sometimes you have to think ahead to get stuff. So who's that? Uh, oh yes, Liz from uh tradition tra traditions with the season or something like that. Yeah, Liz Maria, you're right. Oh, that was so okay. I had to look at the recipe that you go back on your video and check how you did it. I thought you used uh, uh, clay. <laughs> See? <laughs> but it, it looks so good after you did it and you baked it, you know? It's funny because you put that. Didn't you put um you put um butter on it on, on it afterwards, right? To make it brown. Grandma Joe, you don't have to be shy. Look at me. I, I don't even I, 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 some people dress for the party. I, sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. We, we, we love you either way, right, girls? There's nothing to be shy about. You, you be yourself. You don't have to worry about anything. What are they going to do? Put, give you a thumbs down? It is what it is. <laughs> One time using clay and holy moly. 
Really? You made a gumball tree. How does a gumball tree looks like? Look at Kat. So Kat, so when she started the first video she did, she start, she started doing, she was talking real low. Now she's into, now we can hear her better, right, Katzel? Missy Kathy, you're doing great. She has the challenge, guys. Support my girl here. Yeah, we this is Grandma Joe. We laugh here. We look at the video. We start we when she goes late at night. We start talking about animals, or we talk about food, and before we know, we're talking about different things, right, Davida? <laughs> yeah, Ketzel has to go live. Oh, is the volume on the iPad? Oh, okay, I see what you're saying. No, now the last the last few that you've done, they they uh, you can you can hear better, yeah. Oh, that's great, Kathy. That's great that you're going to do it live. That's great. Oh. <laughs> no cheating. <laughs> you're funny. No cheating. How can you cheat that? With that, uh, can you cheat? I use a random, what is it, random org or something like that uh, i think that picks up okay no you put the, the number of people and you assign a number to them and let the thing pick oh like the okay gumdrop that must look nice too is are they big enough to put it in the patio that would be nice to do like a gingerbread if you do big ones for the patio and make a gingerbread scenery for christmas that would be awesome the gun drops i've seen people do um made out of wood they made those um halloween candy that they're like orange and white this is what do i do Oh, okay. <laughs> Old school. <laughs> what do you mean? Uh, what do I do, the, uh, Grandma Joe? I always, Christmas time, that's a statement in my house. I have to have my ginger, I have the gingerbread section. Oh, <clears throat> you go, you know what you have your icon in the top on YouTube? You log into your YouTube. And then next to your face or whatever you have, you know how you have that the the, the little icon here and that the, you have the, the face of the girl with the flowers on the head, the icon. Next to it, there there is a thing that that has like a little camera insignia, and you press there. Now I was wondering, Davida, my question to you is this one: You are doing your live, and I see you reading your messages on your phone, and using the camera or the iPad, I'm not sure. So why are you doing that? You can see your, I can see my messages next to what I'm, and see myself here. I don't get it. You don't need to use your, I have my phone here, look, and it's locked. It's not, I mean, I can go here. If I want to go here, I can do it. But I see my messages next to me. How come you can you can get that done? So that way you don't have to worry about it. Right, Castle is you can see it next to it. It says top chat. You press there and everybody that's there talking that you can see it. And you can go on the side, like next to each person's name, they have like three dots. And if you want to report, remove, put user in timeout, high user on this channel, add a moderator, you can do that next to it. Like if I want to add you as a moderator. I can go next to your name and those three dots and, and go there, press there, and put you as a moderator. You're not using your webcam? You can't read. 
your iPad screen. Oh, so you you don't have a, a, a desktop? The DF is easy. Uh, you can even like catch the, the the for the live. Um, what do you call that? That um, you can go on. The, it gives you it gives you time. It takes a picture of you to do the thumbnail, the thumbnail, whatever you call that. But I use a little webcam, you know. But you can do it also in the in the on the. On the I can use this if I wanted to. The reason why I had the webcam. Is because I, once if I do a project, I want to be able to show you guys. And with my the screen I have, I can tilt it, but I can't tilt it completely down so you guys can see. With the webcam, I can put it up there and bring it down, and you can see what I'm doing. That's why I couldn't. I used to move around with my phone and stuff like that, and I dropped the phone, and God knows what else. With this, it's a little tiny little camera like this, so. It's only, I think I paid, what, 30-something dollars? You didn't, you're not using yours, right, that Davida? I thought you got one. <clears throat> but your iPad, you can, you can enlarge the screen. You can split the screen and enlarge your letters if you want to. Because I had the, the Apple thing. Like, if I want to make these letters bigger, I can do that. Oh, the Logitech, yeah. You're not using that one? You understand, man? Yeah, if you have a, like, if you have it, um, you can do this, like, this computer, if you have a, uh, if you have a thing to attach it on the iPad, you can do that, too. Oh, but the iPad is easier because the iPad, you can put it next to it. Like, if you're doing a project, you can put the iPad sitting on top of something high. You can tilt it somehow. But I don't have an iPad. I have a big most just screen here this like this big i think it's like 18 inches it's, it's this wide <laughs> and you know so i have and it has a camera i can use a camera on my computer i can go to google and do that but the little thing is this tiny and it has a cord i want to get a longer cord but uh who was it that oh karen karen was telling me she was the one who sent that to me I have it attached up there, but it's too high and warm. So she told me to go and get a piece of wood. And you know how I made my desk. My desk is made out of a Walmart table. You know those Walmart tables that you take for picnics? I got that. I went to Lowe's, got myself uh, a, a, ply, a piece of plywood, cut it to the same size of the table, four feet wide. And I went to the tile section. With the, they, had the, they had the uh, linoleum-type tiles got a few of them glued them to my my wood and i made my desk and i can take it with me anywhere and i don't have to worry about it. i just fold my table take my piece of wood and i have a desk i guess so don't feel bad i learned all this stuff with karen and jan jan from jan's crazy life she showed me uh how, she was the one who suggested to get this little camera because i had had Another one that I bought from Best Buy was, which was a hundred something dollars, and I didn't know how to work it, so I returned it. But then when I got this one, it was so easy to do. I don't know what I did, but it was easy to do. So I just downloaded the program, and that's it. And it goes on. I even have synchronized my phone. Like if I want to go, like I can open my 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 page, like I have now here with you guys on my phone. My phone, my computer are synchronized. So, I if I if I'm watching you guys here, and I want to go to my lanai, I just leave you talking here. I can go to my lanai, put this on, and watch you over there. It's synchron you synchronize your systems, and I always shut down my system at night. Always, you never know. So, and Apple always is. I love Apple. <laughs> by the dust <laughs> i got i love this this desktop i really love it because and my uh, i just changed recently this past year my daughter and i like for christmas time we got ourselves we changed our phone from the samsung 7 to the apple phone because my other daughter has apple but we're having problems facetime 
So I was never, and it's so funny. I love the Apple computers, but I was kind of hesitant about getting an Apple phone. But now I love it because the, the, the system is so great. Look who's here. Send me your address, woman. I'm sending this stuff this week. <laughs> Miss Bitty Boo Brown. Another bites the dust, right, Davida? Yeah. Yeah, I have a, that will have to, that, that I show and share with you guys. This, because I like this, because it's going to go well with a little thing, but I didn't want something too big. <clears throat> A little, little top, you know this Walmart. My Walmart doesn't get none of the stuff that you guys show on 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 your videos. Nothing. Not even. Not even. I I I have five or six of them around. Nothing. I I no. I have your box ready to go. It's yours, Castle and Karen. I have to send. And I'm going to send this to Sonia. Hopefully this week when I go, I'll find, see if I can find extra stuff for Sonia. If not, I'll send her mine. It's not like it's going to break me. I have two of those. Let me see. So you're sending it to the G Rogolino 1989 at Gmail? Is that the one you're sending it to? Okay, so I'll know when you send it, click in here and I'll know since I'm on. Let me write it down because what the heck did I put the box? Oh, okay. Let me get a little paper here so I can find it. And it was my fault because the first time you sent it, I was erasing stuff and you know how you go fast on things? Bitty Boo Brown. Let me see if it comes through. See, right now I, I'm on my computer. Yes. I have a, the, the Apple desktop. Yeah, an Apple desktop. I love it, Davida. And let me tell you something. I have one that I thought was old. I gave it to my daughter and it's still working. That one is 10 years old. And all I did was take it once to upgrade. And the only, I think it cost me like uh, two to 300 hours to update a new system, completely new system. And it works like, like Charm. My daughter has it, but I wanted a bigger one. So I got this one. <laughs> Let me see. I don't want to be rude. I just want to check this. EB. I don't want the mail, the, the her address to get lost. Okay. Yeah, I have a, the desktop. It's like, let me take a picture and I'll show you. Let me see. Okay. Can you see? It doesn't have a tower or anything. It's just this. Everything is in the screen. Let me see if you can see it. See, that's how big it is. You see the little camera I was telling you about? Right here? Let me see. Right there. Okay, let me see. Hold on. Right here. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it. Right there. Right there. That's the little camera, the webcam. And it sits there. There you go. Then I have the arm over there. You see the arm? Oops. Let me see if I can show you the arm. I'm thinking I'm doing with this. <laughs> yes. I got it like three years ago for my for Christmas present. Yeah. They, t they tend to last more than the... Than the, the how you call that the the those laptop thing that you guys have and then um you if you don't want to spend a lot of money you buy the, the desktop and you can buy uh this this is the external drive i'll show it to you hold on 
<laughs> it has an internal drive, but I got this external drive, and you you can attach it to it. And then if you want CD, you don't have to get it with CD, depending on how much you want to spend. I have this. I got. I bought this later on. Let me see if I can take it out. Hold on. Uh, full of dust. So let me see if I can take it out of here. Well, it has it. It's like a thing, and it has. I don't know if you can see it. Let me see. Let me move you over here. See this? <clears throat> this is you put the CDs in here, but you can buy these separate if you want to. So you can buy the original computer with the normal things, and then if you don't want, you can always buy this afterwards. And it, it doesn't cost a lot, maybe a hundred and something dollars and when you have the money. And this external drive, you if you want more, and let me tell you this, their support people are amazing. This webcam is a Logitech 665, I think it is. It's tiny. It's I bought it in Amazon, $36. And you can attach it, you just download it's very easy. This is called the my uh, my passport for Mac. And you can uh, you can save everything in here. And this has so much memory. The guy told me I have so much memory memory in my system that he, <laughs> he, I only use like a quarter of, of it so far. And I have it for three years. I used to I used to work with Windows at work, but um, for whatever reason, those systems get hacked so much. I just got scared. Yeah, I mean, I'm not telling you that Apple don't, but I think they're on top of their stuff. They once you register your computer, they I think they they watch everything that you know. Not that they watch what you do, but they keep in top. Like right now, I have a, an update Apple ID setting, so I have to do it. Uh, they send me an update for the iCloud, so I'll view it and I update it, and that's it. Oreo, I'm not. Take this. I learned all this stuff little by little. It took me three. Uh, well, I knew about computers and stuff like the Windows and stuff like that from work. That's what the government uses. But uh, once I had the accident, I lost a lot of my memory. So I have been learning all this stuff. Like, for example, uh, Karen Kane, she helped me a lot. She showed me step by step. Once you show me, I'll, it stays in here. And um, uh, what's her name? Jan's Crazy Life. She also showed me how to use this. She, you know, she told me to get this one, and she says it's easy. Just and she's her husband lo knows about computers, also. So she, she does. I don't know. She I haven't seen her do videos lately, but she has a channel here too. Okay, video. I'll, I'll check it once I uh I get out of here. I haven't seen it come through. Let me see over here. It should be here, but I don't know. Let's see. Close windows, windows, messages. I don't want to be rude, guys. I just want to see if I got this stuff. Like they told them, what's in the video? They told you you were when you were on the phone. <laughs> uh, oh, what the heck is this? I don't know. Let me go to the Gmail. Mailboxes, let me go to the Gmail. I have one here, that's all I have in my Gmail. Let me see on this one. Nope. I don't see it here yet, Betty, but uh, <clears throat> I'll check again. You send oh you're sending it to the GLR. You can send it to that one. I'll check that one, but send it to the G Rogolino1989 at gmail.com. I have two of them in there. If you go to the about on my, my screen, where is it? 
Let me close this. Hold on. Go to my channel. Let me see what I have here. See in the bottom of the page. I don't know if you can expand this. If you go all the way down in the bottom on the about section, if you go to my channel, you in the says section it says about. That has my description. That has my description. Why I'm about. Why did I start my channel and all that kind of stuff. A little description. At the end, it has my email. You're sending it to the GLR. I post it. I don't know because what I have here is my old, my my new ad at um, gbrogolino1989 at gmail.com. <clears throat> That's what I have on my about screen. Where are you looking at? That's my channel. You see what I was saying? Um Grab a Joe over here. I don't know if you can see, because this is the, let me see if I can make this darker. Hold on a second. I learned all this stuff with these girls, guys. Uh, let me go to settings. Let me make this the page a little darker so you guys can see. Let me tell you, there's nothing in the world you cannot learn when you have somebody who's willing to teach you. Where is uh? Purification sound, stern screen time. Where's color? Light. That's um. I'm looking for the the thing here. They have so many things in here. FaceTime. I can even uh, this phone that I got. I can. I have the air. It's called. Let me see. It's called AirDrop. You you videotape with this the the video, and you can AirDrop and send it to your computer, and it'll come through. And all you have to do is edit it to the computer, which is awesome too. I'm looking for the color. To, uh, let me see. To, to darken the color, Y5. This is on, so this is supposed to be off. There you go. So general control, send display. Oh, here we go. Rise awake. Okay, let me look. Okay, I made it darker now. Let me go back to my YouTube channel. Okay. See, Grandma Joe, this is, oops, let me see. This is my channel, right? I went to my channel, and up here, you see there's a little camera over here. That's a camera, that's where you go, you can go, you press there, and it tells you to, to record or to go live. And then, then if you want to look for something, they have also the, let me see this. It has home videos, playlists, and all that stuff. So it's in the top. You see? Like it has like a little video camera. Next to it. There's a three dot. There's a, uh, like an arrow glass. And there's a little camera next to it. Hi, Robin. <laughs> well, <clears throat> I did a little haul. And we're now we're talking about cameras, how to setting setting up stuff, and what's the best thing to get for you know. All right, Billy, let me see. So I was showing uh, Ms. Uh, Grandma Joe how to, um, and then you you and then once you go in there, you press it. It, it tells you put the title. Um, you can do. Uh, let me see. Hold on. I forget. See, it has one for recording, and it has one for video, for live. See. Once I already pressed, and it has one for live and for one for video. So you can do go live or go video. Now, if I want to go record, I go over here. Once you press that icon, I told you first. Or you can go live, which is this one here. I don't know if you can see it. Can you see it? So once you press the icon, when you go into your channel, it brings you here. 
and then you can do one and the other. Then if you want to go live, you press the button that says live. It's going to bring you. So it's not letting me in because I have, uh, I'm on already. So that's why it's not letting me go in. But uh, the other thing, when you use um, this computer, the Logitech, you have to use Chrome. You cannot use uh, Safari. Because if you use Safari, it will not work. It will tell you that you have an error. So you have to download Chrome into your, into your computer. So, so you know. That's, I learned that from Jen, and uh, uh, I downloaded Chrome, and that's how I go. When I go on my to my channel on YouTube, I go through Chrome, not to uh, Safari. I don't know why. And, oh, I know why, because I did call Apple. They said that uh, Logitech company hasn't catch up to, because the computer, my computer is too advanced. It ha they haven't caught up to the advance of the Safari program that they have. So that's why you I cannot use the Logitech system with my Safari. Safari is like a, open, like a window. Like you, when you wanna search stuff, that's where you go to Safari. That's what it's called, it's called Safari. So you have to have Chrome to use the Logitech system. They're not updated yet. They're updated, but they're not, you know, like they, the Apple is too abandoned. Apple is already doing, have you seen that new, Thing that they have they have a, a a big like a scanning cut thing i was looking every time it comes to an announcement and you can take a picture or something put it on that it's like a scanning cut machine and it lasers wood it lasers tin like this like you had your own factory in your house i don't know how much a machine cost but they have they bring they they, they that's the new thing that i seen from them these people are so advanced and ridiculous. Before we know, we're going to be flying in our cars around instead of driving on the road. <laughs> They're going to bring the inno innovation to us. They are so tech savvy, I'm telling you. <clears throat> oh, you're in the... Isn't that amazing? I wonder how much the machine costs. I didn't even open the browser to see how much it costs. I was afraid. <laughs> because as it is, these Apple computers are not cheap either, you know? You want a decent one, you're starting at what, two, three, two, 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 two thousand, three thousand dollars? Yeah, sometimes you can find them like for fifteen hundred, depending on what you get. And the thing here is your, com Safari, your computer updates has to be like people who have older system, Apple systems and they're less than 10.10. .10, you have a problem, you either have to update your system or you're gonna get stuck with the new systems that are coming up. So if you have an old computer or you have an old laptop that's Apple and it's not upgraded to a 10.10, .10, you're gonna have a hard time with all the systems that you wanna download. Hi, Sandra, how are you? I learned all this stuff, let me tell you girls, I learned all this stuff. I bump into the problem that I was driving the Apple people crazy and they, they told me all this stuff. They they check and you know what? Before they tell you anything, you they ask you if they can pair with your system. So they do pair. You know they ask you permission. You authorize it, and they see what you see in the computer. So um, you go there and they tell you, okay, go here. They make sure that you don't have no bugs in your computer every time you call them. That you don't have no bugs in your computer. That they help you clear a lot of the system that you forget to clear. Like sometimes we keep downloading stuff and we forget to clear it that can slow down a computer. So they go through that step and they help you clear all that stuff. I mean, they're great. They're great. I mean, so if you pay $2,000 for a system with them, it's nothing compared to all the stuff that they do with these computers. And I'm not sponsored by them though. <laughs> Disclaim, let me make sure. I just love them. Because I when I, I feel so dumb when sometimes I don't know how to do something. And, and they're so patient. Like if you ask a dumb question, you think it's dumb, but no question is dumb. I don't think so, but that's my opinion. But when you ask a question to them, they're so, so nice and so patient to show you, to to teach you, to uh, to explain to you as many times as you want. It's, it's I, I don't have no complaint with them. I'm stuck with them. <clears throat> so, well, I'm hoping that that information helps you 
if you have any questions, just let me know. I, I try to help you if I know the answer is now. I'll research it. And don't forget to take your recallers, guys. Suck on recallers. All those allergies and all those mucus things that are happening to your nose and your head, recall, I will help it. You guys don't believe me, but it, I'm telling you. I smoke, and you don't hear, see me. I haven't had a cold, thank God. So... Recall a lot, David. Recall, I keep telling you, it, it's, it's full of vitamin. It's full of, uh, it has this uh, pl natural plant that helps your system. You want to see a little bit, Sandra? I changed a couple of things. Look. Oh, wow. Uh, I'm moving, you guys. Let's see what you see. See, I changed a couple of things up there. I have my kitty cat that uh, Judy sent me. See the little uh, turkeys, not turkey, the, the pickup boxes. Those are two that I got last week. I put stuff there that like, like uh, I have all my Halloween stuff in those two, like the stickers and stuff, they're on those peacocks. Um, I changed that up there. Over here, you see what this is right here? I have that there for now, but I wanna put my ribbons. So I am gonna go this week and get a piece of wood and I'm gonna make my own ribbon stand. Karen was showing me something. Then I have, I ID all my papers, what they are. I put the names on it. I'm, you know, in the process. I had changed that a little bit here. This is the side where the door is. This is the door. Let me see if I can show you the finger. This is the door where this is, thing says. And then over here is the wall facing me. So I got some ribbons there, my banner. That's the door. See, the door is open here. And there's uh, Ketsu's little bunny that she sent me. And then I have my paints here. But I think I'm going to change my paint from here to here. To this, once I remove all those ribbons, because it's easier to grab. And then I change all this. I cleaned this yesterday. I have my Tilda there, my other unicorn, and my Disney stuff here. And then over here, I got my crown that I made and I have that that pink doll that that's um that pink doll I made it's a it's a piggy bank that pink doll I share with you guys then over here is the other side by the window and then I have all my ribbons on that big tall thing that I shared with you a couple of weeks ago with my little kitty cat and I have my little Timmy there that's my grandson when he was little and I have all my ink there then if you go up, you see um, the Alice in Wonderland. Uh, uh, what's her name? Tina. With Tina's Crazy Crafty Life. She sent me that in a challenge. Then I have a table. Not a table. I got that little chair. I, I decorated it, and I have stick pins there. Then if you go around, let me let me turn around. I can't pull this up because the cord is short. Uh, if you see here. I had that light there. That's an, uh, one of those odd lights. Over here, I have my stuff. This is like a shelving here unit I had that goes all the way down. I have my cutting things in here. All this is cutting uh, tools. And one of these days, I'll take a camera and do a video. The whole thing. Once I set up, I have those boxes there. I have uh, flowers that I made. They're in there. And I have uh, uh, wood. Uh, things uh, there. These are the three boxes, the red, the black ones that I shared with you last week. And I have my my markers. They are like the, those uh, expensive markers. What do you call them? I forget their name. Uh, up top. What's it called? Uh, let me turn you around. Hold on a second. The thing is getting caught up. Hold on, guys. I don't want to make you dizzy. <laughs> then I changed this. Remember that I had a hole there? The little cubby. So I put these colors. I got that from uh, Walmart. And up there, again, we go to the back. This is an eight by 10 room. This is very small. Then you go around again. And then you have big dreams. And I have all my paper pads up there. I don't know if you can see it. And I have some over here too. My pens that I collect, I have up there, that red thing that you see up there. That's an Alice in Wonderland display that I made a three tier tray. Alice in Wonderland scenery for a challenge when I first started. I have uh, up there 
behind the love sign is a sewing machine that I made out of fabric. And that's my saying with you guys, spread the love. I can't lift my arms, they hurt. Oh, So just a little bit. Let me put you back, guys. Sorry. I didn't want to make you dizzy. Oh, sorry. Yeah, it's a 10 by 8. And it's not a square completely because this wall here where the door is, it's like flat. It's like a, like a half a diamond, I would say. It's like it's square all the way around. And then when you get to this wall here, my right side where the door is, there's the closet over there. And then here. But I like, since I'm short... I like to have everything to reach. You're welcome, honey. I just, I'll show you a little bit. One of these days I'll do a full tour. I just, I get involved in all this stuff, doing my decoration that I get a <laughs> sidetrack. So then my, that piece that I was showing you that I have uh, next to the machinery here, this year, there's a, a black piece. My husband got that from the, the church had that, they were gonna throw it out and he has an adapter to the wall that you can plug in. And it has three shelves in the bottom, so I make like a little curtain to cover it. And um, I have stuff in there. So all I have to do, go to the, you don't see it. You go to the other side, doesn't have the curtain, only this side that you see. And uh, I have there, I have uh, all the baking stuff that I use for the cakes. You're 411. I'm shrinking, guys. So you know, as you get older, you shrink. I was 5'3", I measure myself, I'm five five. Five inches of my five feet tall. Now I shrunk <laughs> three inches. So then I got you know the, my paints and inside this by the door I have this hanging closet. It's like a like a more. I show you when when you saw it before. Um, you open that door and inside there I have uh, glitter and I have paste and I keep stuff like that. And then I have all my wash in this little stand here. <clears throat> So I got this piece over here that you see that's sprayed from, I got them from, um, I got the, this, I was gonna show you this. Hold on a second. Let me close the door so you guys can see. This thing is moving. Okay. You see this here? This is a closet, that, it's like, not a closet, like a little armoire. It looks like a, one of those mirror things, but it opens. And I have my glitter and stuff there. Now this little piece, this plastic that looks like a shoe rack, I got that at Michael's and the painting section. And you can put your bottles there. And this is hanging on the door. It has two, two things that you hang it on the door. And it's, it's a good space saver. So like here, and it has like down here, it has like a magnetic thing. So you can put my magnets, you know, have magnetic things. See, over here, it has like chalkboard, you could show, over here is magnetic too. And over here you can write in chalkboard, but I put a thing there, that's what I did, and then I hang this. But then this opens, hold on a second. Let's see if I can open. So this opens like this, and you can, you put the stuff there, can you see? And then it has the wall here, you can hang stuff here, so. These pieces, you see those pieces? They uh, Tuesday morning was selling them, but I think I I got that, I got those with this this shelf unit. So I ha it has that up there. You can slide things in there like that. Uh, it has on the door here it has things that you, you can ex exchange all this stuff, like all these things here. I'm trying to show you with this cord. All these things here, you can pull them out and put it any height you want because it has holes. You see those holes? You can you can adjust the shelves any size you want. So it's interesting. I got this at Tuesday morning um, two years ago. That it was seventy nine dollars. I got it for seventy nine dollars. Okay, let me close it in. There you go. Sorry, guys. <laughs> and then this piece here, I got the screen a Tuesday morning uh, last year, and it came with these three things. Actually, it came with two. And then lately, they've been selling this stuff. So I got an extra one, and I put it down there, you see? So I have, it's there by colors. So, you know, just a little bit. 
I mean, it's a small room. You know? A what? A troll? What do you mean? What's a troll? I have my Betty Boo over here. <laughs> it's not, it's only 10 by 8, Maria. My room is in by my little fountain, needs a new pump. So I don't have it on. Yes. Yes, Betty. I got the things from uh, from Hobby Lobby during Christmas time. I need to eat my nuts, guys. Yeah, that chandelier, my husband hanged it for me. I need, it needs a new bulb. I haven't changed it yet. You can you can buy the kit in, um, in the store. You make it and then add the things to it. It's just wire. Excuse me. And um, the electrical part you have to buy in Lowe's at Home Depot. You know when you attach it to plug it in. My cat wasn't feeling good today either. He was like slowing and he every time I cried, tried to carry him, he was like hurting. He would complain. Yeah, I usually do the Sunday. I usually do the videos on Sunday. But if I don't do it on Sunday, I do it Mondays or Wednesdays. Excuse me. If I, I do, um, sometimes I do little, little, uh, I don't do often, uh, what do you call that, uh, projects. But I share my projects. I try. I tried to do the umbrella project, and at the end it came out really nice. But <laughs> at the beginning, it looked like a sausage. <laughs> you asking me? Oh, 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 do you know my name? Oh, Oreo. Oreo has the same name. I, I once in a while I do um, I do home tours. I basically do shopping. I try to find the best buys for you guys, you know, which you already know. But sometimes I find great stuff and great places if you have the store around. And um, I do wreaths. I do anything. You imagine I even paint. I just don't do too much tutorials because I'm not good at... I can show you how I do it, but I don't know how to explain it. Like if I'm concentrating when I'm doing the project... I forget to talk. <laughs> I can't I can multitask. <laughs> yeah, I'd like to shop. I like to shop for good bargains. And if you can, if, if I don't find it, you will not find it. Trust me. Because I search everything. Yeah, I paint too. I paint. I paint and um I haven't I haven't done it in a little while but um I have four canvas there that I have to do something with them. So I love painting. I, I do how to crochet, I know how to embroider, I sew in the machine. I just don't do the crochet and the embroider anymore because I have problems with my arms and they hurt really bad. So I try to use them the best way I can, but doing con constant uh, motion of the same thing, these sections here, they hurt so bad that you want to cut off, cut them off. That's how bad they hurt. I'm sorry, I didn't see it. You're talking about this one here? You either can make it or you can, I seen them, I, I have uh, this one particularly, I didn't make this one. This one, I, I bought it at Hobby Lobby a couple years ago. It Was that the one, Sam, that you were asking? Was it Sam that was or Maria? But it's very easy to make. I was looking at it 
you have the bulb you but you don't have to buy the bulb and the uh, the other part is just wire you can decorate it when you want and then you can handle the chandelier crystals you get them i found them at hobby lobby yeah I do with it though. I, I don't have a um, crochet with two needles or one needle. I can embroider things. And guys, remember the fabric that I got from the, the lemon fabric? Now I know how I'm going to do my runners because that was kind of, it was bothering me. And let me show you something. I had gotten this fabric from Hobby Lab, I think it was, or Joanne's. <clears throat> I don't remember. But I had gotten three yards. And it was too much lemons. And those are lemons. Remember I showed you the place? I cut some of these lemons and put it on the plate. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get burlap to make the runner. And then I'm going to make like ruffle things. I'm going to use this to make the ruffle for the end. And put them at the end. So that way it doesn't look too... Because it's too much lemon. Look. Yeah, from how... Okay, Davida. You know your stuff, girl. So these are the same lemons I cut and I put the place that I showed you. So I got that. So I have bought this to do something else and I end up doing nothing with it. But I'll come up with another idea, this one, because <clears throat> I wanted to use the background for the pictures, these pictures. But I ended up painting and putting something else, the frame, because my theme is blue and this is black. So I might buy blue, or might look, actually not buy, let me look in my bins first. If I have blue and I might mix this with the blues and the yellows and make like a, one of those um, things that I'm a, uh, what's her, uh, one of those garlands that you make with fabric. So, I was already going to use them with this. See, David, I got almost the same one as you look. And then I got this one. And all these frames were painted. I painted them. And then over here, I put her like in the background. And over here, there's uh, uh, this stuff. And I made a braid and I put it around. And I just printed it. And I use that paper that I shared with you guys last week that it looks like fabric that I made the bunny from. So we all learn. So that's what I'm gonna do with this. And I think I might, I have yellow here. I think I'm gonna get and make two like, a, you know the holders, the, the pot holders sometimes they get go bad or they when you wash them they the colors start fading away i could take this that fabric and make myself the, the pot holders too because it's thick enough for that just take the old one that's washed and sew it away yeah hobby lobby has the most beautiful fabric i can imagine i like their fabric better than the ones at joanne's believe it or not the hobby lobby is the best I can't tell you. This is good for your bones, girls. Okay. What question, honey? I didn't see. Did she make the question? Let me bring you down. Okay. Who has a question for me? Robin, she's talking about the table you and my machine are on. What table? Oh, this? This here? This was, uh, oh, these are just uh, two, um, you know, like 
uh, IKEA sell the Alex units, but these ones are from Hobby Lab, uh, from Michael. So I got the two things, they roll around. I just put them there against that thing. And when I'm gonna use the, the actually that thing there, this. You see where the boxes are? Let me move the boxes out of the way. See this? Let me move you over here. This is like a thing to put a TV. It's like remain school, you used to put this on the TV. So I have my stuff there. I have my baking stuff there, I have my jewelry stuff there. And then this has a plug here. This is plugged to the wall, it has a plug in the wall. This has a plug here, you can plug the machines. It has already has electricity. So I covered it with this. And this big piece, whoops, something fell, something fell. Oh, my rolling pin fell. My rolling pin. You can move it. See? You can move it here. And you can plug it in here. Or you can leave it there, too. And these are drawers. I have my, my uh, things here, like uh, the wires for flowers. Um, how you call that for fishing? Metals. Uh, the, those things are uh, metals. I have my uh, scrapers here, my punching thing here. This is little dick tacks I have here, little containers. My doilies and flowers that I made. Then you put it back. This is my scanning cut. I made a table out of everything. You have to be in, uh, put this in here. There you go. And then I made this to cover it. Then this one here moves. See, I can move both of them. They have wheels. This is a Gemini. You make a table out of it. I have all my uh, things here, like the sticky thumb and stuff like that for cards. Vercro. The little dots I was showing you, everything that's like sticky things is in here. And I have extra papers here that are decorative, something fell. This is like a staples and stuff like that and glues. I have bolts here and pencils there. Then you move it back and it turns into a table. You use the square and then you have square footage here. This one moves around anywhere I want. This one I can put it here and it has space. This is the center. It has one, two, three. It has like um, tiles. It has like three this way, which is plenty of space because I have three and a half and three and a half. And over here, it has one, two, three, four, five. So it's five and a half, like six this way, and two inches that way to put this stuff. That's an eight by 10 square footage room. Are those the table you were talking about? What the, the things, oh, I have, they used to be underneath the table here, where I have, because they fit underneath the table. I have three of them down here where I'm sitting because this is the test I made. But I want to, um, I change it. I put these two here and then I put one inside there. Inside that thing, there's one inside there facing that way. If I can open it and close it. So like I have um, the closet is here and the table is right here on this side. And it has my big shot on top, and I have space to store things in here. I will have to get the phone and show you with the video, you know? My pants are falling off. Let me show you. Oh, this wasn't the table. Which table are you talking about, Sandra? The one that I'm sitting on? The one that's in front of me? Yeah. 
Yeah, you make a table. The, the, the desk, I didn't go and buy no freaking expensive desk. Like, if I want to use this table underneath that I have here, I'm sitting in front, for example, a picnic. I need it for a picnic, a picnic outside for something. I can bring these two units, put it underneath here, sit the wood that I have here that I made for the top, in top of them, and pull the table out and use it outside. This one here, this table is from Walmart. I can't show you because this is not long enough. Let's see, hold on. I don't want it to happen like it happened last time. You see this table? This is a Walmart table. You see this is the thing, you fold it, it folds into half. This is a wood that I got from Lowe's. And this here are tiles. They look like wood, but they're tiles. And they're sticky tiles. The, four, the 12 by 12 tiles. And this table, I have I put both the piece of the plywood and this piece of plywood here. It's uh I, I bought the, the the whole sheet, the length, you know, and he, the guy cut it to four feet, which I want. I wanted it four feet from here to this side here. And then down here, you see I have this, has all my fabric like this. And I have space to put stuff in when I'm sitting here too. And then over here, you see all my things here? These are, I have these things that I got. They have all my cutting tools there. And then I have my printer there. This stuff is gonna go away. That's, that's the stuff I just showed you. Then it goes higher. And I have my laminator there. The printer, the computer. Okay, I can show you yourself. Then I have this, since I have a cordless uh, keyboard, I have this, this is like where you put, um, you, when you buy for the plates, see the plates? This You, you can put this in, the, in your kitchen to, to store the plates, one in top, you know, like savers. You buy those, it has an, ex it, it comes with the two piece. I got that on Tuesday morning. And you add it and you make a desk and I have my computer in top, see? This is my computer, this is my, oops. This is all, this is the whole computer, this piece and this piece. Then I have that there, that I put stuff there when I'm, you know, that white stuff. And these are my stickers there. And over here I have this little trolley that I bought at Michael's and I cut the legs off because it wasn't worth nothing and I just put it on the floor. And I have my six by six there. And uh, this is the Weird Memory Keeper. And this is a bow maker. This is the best bow maker you can buy. So simple, guys, to make a bow. This thing. So, I mean, this this piece of, this is 18. That's how big this is. And the table itself is four feet. But I have space on this side. And I have this, you see I have my little cutting scissors here and stuff like this. And then I have this, this is here for the, I have this little thing, I got Dollar Tree that has some measuring things and cutter cuts and the pump pump maker. And my, this piece for my glue gun, I ordered that online from some lady in Ohio. Her husband made them. So I saw her and um, this is back like three years ago and he made it for me and I painted it pink. My glue gun, you see? Now that chandelier, I got a Hobby Lobby. That, that's not the one I made. I made one, but I didn't make that one. That was Hobby Lobby three years ago. Now this bow maker is the best thing to make a bow. So easy. This one, I bought it from this guy. I have the paper, uh, but I have to dig for the, the thing. I have it in, um, let me hold on, let me put this down. I'll tell you, uh, this bow maker is the easiest thing. It's better than the... I'm telling you, let me put this over here. Let me put this out of the way. I don't want this to break. Let me give you a demonstration on the bowl maker. I can find the information for you if you want. Let me bring you that. This thing is so easy to make a bowl. And it's light, and these things are removable. You can make a little, you can make a big, see? 
it's plastic. And I think it, it costs, uh, it, oh, it's called Decafon. Made in England. It's called Decafon. Deco, D-E-C-O-F-U-N. Uh, I remember the guy's name was Kent, I think his name was. And let's see if I can read it here. Uh, yeah, it's called deck of fun, but you can move this thing around. Let me show you this. So freaking easy to make a bow. Cut a piece. I'm gonna take this. Is the bow is gonna fade? It's gonna go sideways, but you need a piece. You don't have to do this, but I do it because you see, you put the the. the the tie there, whatever you're going to tie it up. Why is it so light? <clears throat> okay. It's still there. Okay. Can you see better now? You take the ribbon. You put it right here in the front. Right? Very easy. You go around this. And you go inside this again. I'm gonna well, this is too big. Let me make it smaller. This is huge, this bowl. And this is this doesn't have wire. There. So you put it around, you go around this little thing, this little tower, and then you go inside. Go around the other tower right here. Okay. Go around and then go inside the tire, the tower of that tower. Listen to me. This side here, go around, inside, go around, inside, and I have two loops here and two loops here, right? You can leave it at that. Let's leave it at that because I'm not, you know, you can make it as 20,000 loops if you want. Cut that. Come over here. You can use this as the back. You could do the other one. You go right here. That's the back, because the legs are fa the legs are facing forward. You tie it up, and there's the bow. That's it. And you finish tying it with a knot, you know, here. As simple as that. And that's it. You pull them down, and it's easier on your hands. There you go. And you have a bow. You don't have to worry about turn it this way, turn it that way. <laughs> as simple as that. And it's so cheap. They're cheap. They're not maybe twelve dollars, ten dollars, or maybe less. It's called deco deco. What did I say? Deco fun. Then you can bring the leggies down. And cut them, and you have a bow, and then you put in whatever you, which project you want. They have it, and Michael's has uh, that bow maker, whatever. That thing is so complicated, forget it. And you put it down somewhere. That's it, and you can fix it the way you want. You don't have to worry about turning the legs or nothing. And you can do the same thing with a small one, with a big one. You can make it as big. Let me tell you how big this is. Mm hmm. You can make it as big as a 10 inch bow. So the loops, you know, this is 10 inches wide. Then if you wanna make, uh, you don't wanna use this, and you wanna make, you know how Arlene, Arlene of Country Craft makes her bows, the, what do you call the, those crazy bows that she makes? You can use this to hold them down too. Like you can put the legs this way. Like, you know, when you cut them, what is it called them? I forget the name. Oh. The funky bow. You know how she does the funky bow that she takes loops, put it there, and then you can, you know, you cut the things and you can measure this. You can use these things as measurements because this side, this side are the same. It's just, you know, let me bring you up. I'm like talking to myself over here. This, like a funky bow, these sides, and they measure five and five. I, I ordered it online from this guy, uh, 
But you go Deco Fun on Amazon and you might find it. And it's very light, it's simple to use, easy to store because it's light. You can put it this way, that way. I have it anyway, you know. If it's nice because it's, it's ten, it, and in, because the other ones are really expensive. That stuff that they sell out there, and then it's so complicated trying to figure out. That one that has the fingers, that's a pain in the neck. I mean, I know how to make bows. I don't need that. But sometimes if you want them very, it's not in Amazon. Do you check? Really? Search um, Deco Fun Bow Maker to see what they say. I'm trying to read this in here, but I can't see because it's why. Fun for a lifetime. Let me see. Hold on. They have it, they have it. Uh, I'll tell you in a minute. See, they have the video here. Put Deco Fun on the search bar, it comes up. Let me see where they sell it. It says Deco Fun Bow Maker, Five River Row, Wilton, Connecticut. Rated five based on 15 reviews. I am so excited. It's, it's just a good thing, it is easy to make. So they're located, they have a five star rating. It's called Deco Foam Bow Maker. Let me see if they have uh, a website that they can go to. Okay, the website is the company is owned by. Uh, you can go Deco Foam Maker on the search bar, and it will bring you. It's like a, a shop now with Etsy.com. His name is Ken, and let me see. It says www dot, double dot, you know that, www.etsy.com slash shop, the ribbon place, something like that. That's what it says here. They have a number. It's 203-662-0125. That's the phone number. And that this is how it looks like. And when he you buy it, he sends it to you with a couple of ribbons so you can try it. Bring this thing down so maybe they glare. That's how it looks like. Yeah. Oh, that glare. Hold on. This thing went dead on me. Okay. Grand tour, Miss Bella. So if you don't know how to make bows, go buy this little thing. See? You can do bags and everything. This is the best thing. So you learn about bows. You learn about computers, cameras. What flowers, honey? Robin. So go to the to that thing and you can you can find it, okay? And let me see how much it is. Hold on, let me find out. Let me go back. I bought it like three years ago, so I don't remember how much it was. Oh, it's 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 nineteen ninety nine. That's how much it is. And he also sells um ribbons too he usually sends you the package with this with um with a couple of ribbon samples like like a roll of something the flowers These are some points that I made. Let 
this ones and the pink one then this is a big pair of a big one that's the little the box this is a die but you don't have to get the die if you have the punches those are some of them i make those i make the ones with fabric oh my god i've been here two hours guys yeah so those are poinsettias You have to, they're flat because I have them in the drawer, but you have to take a thing and, you know, fold them. And I distress them. I make a little bit of everything. I try, at least I try. But if you guys don't have a problem with, the, with making bows, this is the best thing to get. Easy, easy peasy. All you have to remember when you go around, every time you go around, you have to put the ribbon in between here. So that way, because you, you don't, you're not gonna be able to pull it out. And now what I do, I always put like a piece here. If I'm gonna make a big, big bow, I usually use it. If I'm gonna make a simple bow, I don't. So. Yeah, I've been here for two hours, okay, guys, and you know, Thank you for giving my the thumbs up, guys. I really appreciate you. Share, you know, don't forget to share. So, have a blessed one, Marie, um, Robin. <laughs> so, I hope you enjoy the little haul and the conversation here and the trick with the computers. If you need any help, I don't know much, but whatever I know, I'll, I'll show you, I'll teach you, I'll help you. I'm not a good, uh, I don't I don't know how to, uh, I try to um, do crafts, you know, like show you how to do certain things, but the problem with me is that I'm too slow. I'm very intricate, I, I, I'm very picky about what I do. That day with the thing, with the umbrella. But it came out nice, right, Betty? You can store stuff inside that umbrella when you're not using it and hang it in, the, in your craft room. Thank you, Hannah. I really appreciate that for you for saying that. I try. Why keep your... I always say knowledge is worth nothing if you cannot share with other people. Some people don't like to share, but if you don't share what you know, it's like nothing. It's like a lost cause. Look at the bow. How cute. You can put it on your hair. It has four legs. You can cut the bag legs. Those, those are the ones I tied it up. You can use jute twine. Look how pretty. And this one has two legs. Two legs. Two, two, two things. This is what you do. Pull it to the side. There you go. I made my own funky bow. <laughs> I can make it in the air. I can... Let me see, what's the back? This is the back. This paper, this doesn't have wire. That's what the, the problem with this is. But and if you have problems, guys, with um with when you have um river like this that doesn't want to stay, you take a little bit of spray, hairspray, far away, and you spray it after it touches it, let it dry, and then you can shape it any way you want. You don't have to worry about it, it doesn't have wire or not. That's a little trick. Little hairspray. It'll smell good. And you don't have to worry about it. Like this one doesn't have wire. I hear the cat. He hears me talking. He's in the other thing. This is so pretty, but it has like a... Look. It has a... What do you call that? A unicorn. God, my brain is going flat. <laughs> yeah, little spray. You know how spray sticks? Just a little bit. You don't want, you spray and you can just go like, you know how you put that perfume? 
like that, and just go like that. Let it sit a little bit, like a mist, and you attach to the 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 fabric or the ribbon, and it makes a little what do you call a uh, stiff, and then you can move it around. Yeah, so there you go. That's a bow there for you. I can make bows anywhere I want. I, it's like so easy for me. See? And the flowers. I made rosettes. I want one, one of these days I'm going to show you how to make the flowers out of um, the roses out of ribbon. They're so easy to make. So easy, guys. So easy. When you see it, you're going to say, oh, my God. See? You have to do is just do this. I don't turn my, my things at all. You pull this leg over here, the other get over there. That's it. See? You tie it. Well, my friends, I've been here two hours. I hope other people can watch this. It's been two hours. Well, if they don't want to watch it, they miss a lot of things, right, guys? We talk about a little bit of everything. I know some of you, I don't know which time you girls are. I'm, it's 12 o'clock, 30 here. That's early for me. I usually go late. I hope you enjoy the little chit-chat, the little uh, haul I had. And I guess this weekend I'll be coming with something else. Let me see what I... This weekend I'm planning to make um, for here... Back there where the cat is, I want to make a ribbon stand. Put my big ribbons. So they slide in. And I'm going to move that there somewhere. Maybe I'll move that there over here. Let me see. Yeah, I think that's going to fit here. So that's going to be a change. Big hug, a big kiss. I love you girls. I hope you girls are doing good. And for those who are... Sick and afflicted. I may the Lord bless you and give you lots of health. Thank you for coming by. I'm sorry about my appearance, but this is the best you're gonna get for now today. <laughs> you all pray for me. Um, I just got a, a call from one of the agents. Um, we're planning to buy a, another home because we're renting this one here now. Um, and I fell in love with this house. It's, it looks like a cottage. It has a little balcony in the front. I already decorated the house, let me tell you. It has, when you come in, it's going to have, it's like an office, but it's going to be my craft room. The lady uses it now for her sewing room. Then it has three bedrooms, the master with a jacuzzi. Beautiful. This beautiful. And then the, what I like that about the house is that the front has like a, those banisters that look like a, from the old country, like that. So, I'm hoping it's 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 it's, uh, it's 600 feet more than what I have now, which is great. It has a nice yard. It doesn't have a pool, but I can always uh, have a, a, a above ground pool. It's cost it costs less. Uh, it's better to maintain, and you you pay less taxes. Though the taxes here are not bad. They're 2,900 something like that, if that. So. But I'll be, I'll be keeping in touch with you guys. I hopefully I'll do a video once I'm doing. I'm going to try to do like the girls do. Like, you know, they show a little piece and how they decorate. I don't know if you want to do that, me to do that, or you want me to do the whole thing and then show you. It's up to you. So I'll be talking to you guys. Take care and have a blessed one. Bye-bye.